All right, y'all, so you probably can hear the TV music back there, but I'm gonna give y'all a quick little tour of the room. We've done it, or I've done it before, um, but I thought I would just show you guys again. Um, Emma's also in here, right there. Um, we're gonna get our stuff from the car here in a minute um, and everything to put in our room. But again, I'm gonna show you guys the room really quick. Okay, so when you come in, there's a door right here that you come into and then off to the left is the little pull down bed nightstand and it comes with tons of plugins and outlets um, so you shouldn't have a problem with finding all of that. Then there's a little cubby right there to put stuff in and then a nice open space to put things. Also, this can convert into a table or you can pull it down into a bed which the bed's really comfortable also um, this is where Emma and I usually sleep when we are on our family vacations and then here's another bed right here and beside this bed the pull down bed and this bed right here share a nightstand right here same as the other one just a little bit smaller and then there's some more outlets and some light switches. And then there's lights right there, which that one's not on, but that one is. Um, and then on the other side of the bed is another one with outlets and a light switch. And then there's this cute little retro looking Mickey Mouse artwork that is super cute. I love that. And then right here is the sliding door to the sink which i'll show here in a minute but i'm going to show this really quick this is really nice um this is just my dad's book bag that he takes to the parks um but lots of hanging space for purses fanny packs lounge flies whatever you need to put right there that's a really nice space um right here i'm gonna move this over more outlets right there and then a nice big dresser space which i'm going to try to get into the camera um and then more outlets right there but this is a nice counter space and then in here we have some room more some more storage that you can put in there a bible and then you have a safe right here which is really nice and then an extra pillow and then some more space to put some storage. And then, I think I, this music's a little loud. I'm gonna turn that down. Um, and then you have drawer spaces right here, which is really nice. The only thing that I don't like about these drawers is the packing cubes do not fit in there. And it was kind of hard on our last trip to put all of the clothes in here. Um, but we made it work out. But if you don't have packing cubes, it's a really good space and area um, to put your clothes or whatever you need. And there are three of those. And then underneath is some storage, sorry, some storage um, for like luggage and everything. And then right here, more outlets, trash cans, and then you have this nice little like bar area, coffee bar area, whatever you would want to call it, snack area. Um, there's a refrigerator, like cooler right here. And then a nice little drawer to put some things. Then you got the coffee pot, some coffee and some things to go with that. Um, there's also tea. I don't know if there's hot chocolate. I don't think so, but all of the coffee essentials right there, cups, and then an ice uh, bucket to put ice in. This is a really nice little area. And then we have a really good view again. This is probably one of my favorite views other than the previous rooms we've stayed in the last couple of times we've been at Pop Century. Um, but this one's really nice and it's really close to the one, the other room that we've stayed in previously. But here's our window and this is our view. I guess I can show you guys really quick. There was somebody that walked by. But that is what it looks like 
right there. It's really nice. Um, and then we're going to go to the bathroom. All right. The bathroom area is pretty, um, a pretty good size. So we're going to start over here on the right side. As soon as you walk in, it is like a little hanging area. And then you have some storage down there that you can, um, use as well. But I love using these if we have a nice restaurant or just like a jacket or something that I need to hang up. So these are really nice to use. And then beside it, there is an ironing board if you need to use that. Lots of storage right here. You have the cabinet storage, which has the iron and the hair dryer. And then you got some more tissues, toilet paper, and then these are some more washcloths tissue box and it's really easy to remove it all you do is just take that off like you just pull it up and then you can exchange it out but lots of counter space um, to use and then there's one sink right here more counter space we love the h2o um, products that's why I always use their products um, except for the shampoo but I love the h2o products that Disney offers um, and then here's more space right here. A big, huge mirror with lots of light. A makeup mirror, which I don't find myself using this often, but I know sometimes my sister and mom use it. More outlets, light switch, um, more space right here. And then an area to hang a towel. And then a good space to put more things if you need to. And then we're going to come into the bathroom area with the toilet and the shower. So as soon as you come in to the right, there is a hanging area for your towels, washcloths, and some um, just other hanging areas. If you need to use it, the shower is a pretty good size. Um, it's really nice also. Oop. All right, so here's a little cubby for you to put some shower things in and then Disney does offer which like I was saying I love the H2O products um, they offer shampoo conditioner and then this is my favorite the body wash it smells so good and then it's gonna be just a normal shower uh, stand-up shower so it's really nice and then you have the toilet area the toilet paper all of the other stuff uh, that goes with a bathroom and then the nice thing that we like is you can just shut it off so if someone's in the shower or using the restroom um, then someone can like brush their teeth or be in the sink area um, without being disturbed so um, that's a really nice feature also but I think this is everything except I guess I can show the sliding door you can also use the sliding door if you wanted to instead um but that is it for the tour all right y'all so that is it for the tour um hopefully you got a good little like glimpse of what the pop century room is uh this is just a standard size room we have a really good view though um if you have like any questions about the room, you can leave them in the comments and I can try to answer as best as I can. Um, but hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye y'all.